A young child is observed wandering around their bedroom shortly after awakening from a nap. It's 7 p.m., an unusual hour for the child who typically remains sound asleep until the following morning, as confirmed by the mother. This unexpected awakening raises eyebrows, hinting at an anomaly. While initially appearing like a routine event, the unfolding events in the footage soon reveal an unsettling twist, leaving the mother convinced that this incident was undeniably peculiar. Given the child's limited ability to communicate, restricted to babbling, their first-hand account remains elusive. Here's what is caught on security camera. Only four months have passed since the family moved into their new home, yet already they're confronted with an inexplicable occurrence. In the recorded footage, a voice distinct from the child's emerges, despite the fact that the child's verbal abilities are still limited to babbling. But a mysterious voice can be heard. The mother visibly unsettled by the peculiar voice resembling that of a little girl conversing with her son, shares the video in hopes of finding an explanation. This unsettling incident, compounded by footage capturing her son's legs seemingly being pulled off the bed, sparks speculation among viewers of a supernatural presence. However, the ultimate judgment remains in the hands of the observer. Is this evidence of a ghost captured on camera, or could there be another explanation for these eerie occurrences? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Shiro, accompanied by Tei and two friends, ventured to one of the numerous abandoned houses scattered across Japan. Upon arrival, the group collectively decided to divide and explore different areas of the desolate residence. Shiro, Sensing heightened activity in the living room, opted to investigate that area alone. Suddenly, a chilling sensation crept over Shiro as he heard an unsettling noise behind him. In a heart-stopping moment, the string nearby was violently shaken, sending a shiver down his spine. あ、待って、ガキじゃん。あ、危ない、危ない、危ない。あ、ダメだ。ガキじゃん。ダメだ、ダメだ。おお、ねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねねね
a white figure materializes on the left side of the entrance before vanishing into thin air, leaving behind a sense of eerie mystery. Meanwhile, unbeknownst to Tei, Shiro, who remained inside the house the entire time, also captures a spine-chilling occurrence on film. As the group of ghost hunters reviews their photographs, they stumble upon a chilling discovery. One image depicts a pair of blurred and incomplete legs, seemingly belonging to someone standing in front of them. The eerie nature of the photograph raises the question, did the ghost hunters capture a genuine apparition on camera, or is there a more rational explanation for the unsettling image? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Italian YouTuber Fancy has built his channel around sourcing amusing and quirky internet videos to entertain his audience. Straying far from the realm of the paranormal, Fancy proudly asserts that he has never encountered anything remotely supernatural until an unexpected incident shatters his skepticism. During the recording of a routine gaming video for his channel, an inexplicable occurrence transpires, leaving Fancy perplexed and unsettled, unable to provide a rational explanation even to this day. Bene, ma direi che possiamo passare al prossimo livello di Damor, Fancy 3. Proviamo, ragazzi, sono curioso di vedere quello che accadrà. Dobbiamo scaricare la canzone. Ok, ragazzi, fermi un secondo. Ho sentito un rumore fortissimo, ma io sono a casa da solo. Spero sia il vento, ma non credo, visto che io chiudo sempre tutto, perché altrimenti ci sarebbero casini mentre registro. No, non è possibile. Ragazzi! No, adesso vi devo far vedere. No, vi giuro, raga, non è possibile. Allora ragazzi, sono andato a controllare cosa potesse essere il rumore Stiamo un attimo calmi C'è la luce del bagno accesa Vi giuro, io sono a casa da solo, non so se lo potete vedere Stavo registrando, ho sentito il rumore della porta chiudersi e c'è la luce accesa Raga, non sto scherzando Allora, entro Raga, sto tremando, vi giuro. Allora, come potete vedere, non c'è assolutamente nessuno qua dentro. Perché c'è la luce accesa e la porta ha sbattuto? Raga, vi giuro, sono a casa da solo e tra l'altro c'è la finestra chiusa. Quindi non può essere stato di certo il vento, per cui non so come sia possibile che la porta si sia chiusa da sola e si sia accesa anche la luce da sola. Cioè, io vi giuro, ho spento tutto, ho chiuso tutto, proprio perché dovevo registrare. Facciamo finta di nulla, diciamo che è stato il vento anche se era tutto chiuso. Ok, ragazzi, rieccoci. Non so cosa sia successo all'improvviso, la porta del bagno si è chiusa. Ah! Ragazzi, no, vabbè, giuro, adesso mi sto cagando in mano, però veramente. Raga, sto tremando. Sta succedendo qualcosa di strano e non sto scherzando. Ragazzi. La porta l'avevo chiusa Raga si poteva vedere prima che ho chiuso la porta quando sono entrato No raga vi giuro Che cavolo sta succedendo Cioè ha sbattuto a caso Ma poi con quale violenza No raga No ragazzi dai ma non scherziamo Ragazzi C'è la luce accesa di qua Ragazzi era spenta prima L'avete potuto vedere Sono passato da qua Ed era tutto spento No ragazzi ma non scherzo Cioè Perché c'è la luce accesa qua de... Vi giuro 
No ragazzi sto impazzendo Ma che cavolo sta succedendo Raga vi giuro non lo sto facendo apposta Raga sto tremando da morire Non so se si vede Ok ragazzi Via io non ce la faccio Quando succedono queste cose Prendo E me ne vado assolutamente Adesso mi vesto Vado in macchina Perché mi sto cagando in mano Non so quello che sto facendo Sto impazzendo raga No ragazzi No ragazzi vi... Raga vi giuro su quello che volete Si vede Ragazzi Ragazzi si sta muovendo Via Via assolutamente Non me ne frega nulla Alexa buonanotte Ma va a cagare non mi interessa The YouTuber is abruptly jolted by a resounding bang Echoing from within his apartment Investigating the source He discovers his bathroom door forcefully slamming shut Accompanied by an inexplicable illumination of the lights Despite feeling unnerved He attempts to resume his gaming session. However, his tranquility is short-lived as the door to his office violently flings open beside him, sending shivers down his spine. To his dismay, the bedroom light now flickers ominously, accompanied by unsettling sounds permeating the air. His unease escalates further upon witnessing a rocking chair in another room, swaying eerily of its own accord. Feeling overwhelmed, the YouTuber decides to vacate his apartment temporarily, seeking respite from the unnerving occurrences. During his absence, a motion-activated camera positioned towards his office door captures a sight that sends chills down his spine. As the footage unfolds, an unsettling figure emerges, drawing near to Fangxi's office door before gradually vanishing into the shadows. Fangxi, adamant that he was alone at the time, is left stunned by this inexplicable occurrence. Could this be Fangxi's inaugural brush with the paranormal? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Alex, from the YouTube channel Hunting the Unknown, embarks on a daring investigation of an ancient abandoned nun convent located in the southern region of England. This historic edifice served a dual purpose, functioning both as a convent and an asylum catering to the mentally ill. Spanning over a century, the institution harbors a shadowy past, rife with tales of supernatural phenomena. Among the spectral entities reputed to haunt its halls is the apparition of a sorrowful nun purportedly lingering within the confines of the old asylum. Venturing into the eerie depths of the convent alone, armed solely with a camera and flashlight, Alex is immediately engulfed by an oppressive atmosphere, sensing an unseen presence lurking in the shadows, observing his every move. Hello, is anyone here? Hello? As Alex delves deeper into the abandoned convent, he becomes increasingly unsettled by the inexplicable sounds echoing through the corridors. In a chilling turn of events, Alex's camera captures something utterly horrifying. Did you catch it? As the investigator traverses the vacant corridors of the old asylum, oblivious to the looming presence nearby, the camera captures an ominous figure lurking within one of the derelict rooms. The silhouette bears an uncanny resemblance to the tales of the sorrowful nun said to haunt the convent. 
Was this spectral entity indeed watching over Alex during his exploration? The answer remains elusive, leaving viewers to ponder the mysteries of the paranormal. For the full exploration, head over to the YouTube channel, Haunting the Unknown. A young woman in Japan alleges that her grandmother possessed a photo album believed to be cursed, which she kept securely locked away in one of her cupboards. The woman suspects her grandmother may have delved into occult practices, suggesting a connection between the cursed album and her grandfather's mysterious demise 12 years prior. Reportedly, her grandfather's death, officially ruled as suicide within their home, raised suspicions due to peculiar circumstances surrounding the incident. The young woman recounts her own encounter with the cursed album, claiming to have viewed its contents before falling seriously ill shortly thereafter. Since the passing of her grandmother, the young woman remains gripped by fear concerning the unsettling photo album and the home it resides in. Seeking assistance, she turns to the anonymous paranormal investigator Kaneko, urging him to remove and destroy the album. She cautions him, revealing that all who have laid eyes upon it have fallen ill, with some family members even believing the album possesses the viewer. Reluctantly, Kaneko ventures into the aged, desolate home, determined to retrieve the cursed album. Yet, as he delves deeper, he too begins to succumb to an inexplicable illness, compelling him to hastily vacate the premises, leaving his phone and camera behind in his frantic escape. The YouTube channel Fourth Wall is enlisted to recover Kaneko's equipment and scrutinize the footage captured. What they unearth in their analysis is profoundly unsettling. The retrieved footage from the phone, functioning as a static camera, reveals a startling occurrence. A portrait of the woman's deceased grandfather inexplicably tumbles to the floor, the cause remaining elusive. However, the unsettling revelations do not end there. Kaneko's recording captures the pivotal moment when he locates and peruses the cursed photo album. Yet, amidst the unfolding events, something alarming transpires, something so chilling that Kaneko professes to have no recollection of the incident whatsoever.
たいもの Kaneko is startled by a peculiar noise emanating from within the confines of the house. Upon turning to investigate, an eerie sight unfolds. A figure appears to kneel behind the glass of a sliding door. Yet, perplexingly, Kaneko maintains that he was alone in the house at the time. Upon scrutinizing the footage, the YouTube channel Fourth Wall speculates that the woman's grandmother might have been implicated in her grandfather's demise and that his restless spirit might be tethered to the mortal realm, unable to find peace. This mysterious video was captured by a group of friends somewhere in India during their night drive into the forest. While driving through the forest in the darkness, they suddenly encountered something bone-chilling. At one point, a mysterious woman appeared in the middle of the road, which scared them to the bones. Soon after the encounter, they ran away as fast as they could. So, who or what was she? And what was she doing in the forest in the middle of the night? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below.